This video will go over how to set up G-Reminders so that your clients can schedule meetings directly on your calendar with a Google Meet automatically added. To set up your schedule, you're going to want to click your initials or picture in the upper right-hand corner of our homepage. Next, you'll click Event Types, and then we will click Create My First Event Type. You'll want to fill out the following information. Let's pretend that we're a financial advisor. The name of our meeting will be Financial Review. And over here to the right is where you put the description of the meeting. For these purposes, we are going to write initial review of your financial goals. Next, you'll see our location field. This is where you'll choose your Google Meet. Note that this option will only be available if you're connected with your Google Calendar. We also offer integration with Zoom, GoToMeeting, and WebEx. View our other videos if you want to see how those work. Next, we'll answer a couple of questions for how we want it booked. This is how far in advance you can book it, the duration of our meeting, how far out from the actual event that they can book, and then how you can schedule it on your calendar. Now, as far as availability here, this is where you will check which calendar it's going on. If you have multiple calendars, you can click on the Manage Calendars down here and that will show all the calendars that you have available and it'll also show which ones you would want it booked against. So you may be booking it on one calendar, but it's checking the availability on all if you have that right-hand column checked. Next, we'll set up our availability based on the days of the week. You can click this advanced and you can pick different times for every day. And then the next section is going to be the questions you want to ask prior to scheduling. This will determine how it goes on your calendar and what information there is. So the event title would read this way and the description would be down below with the phone number of your client. Now you've created your first event type. Up here is the link to your personal booking page. Let's copy that and we'll open that in another window so you can see what your client would see. This is the page your client would see. If they click on the event, it'll bring up your availability. Let's pick a time. And then we're going to fill out this information as if we're your client. Now you can see the meeting has been booked. This is the email that you will receive showing that a meeting has been booked on your calendar. And then let's go back to G Reminders and you'll see it on your calendar booked right here. And that's how easy it is to schedule directly on your calendar using G Reminders. Happy scheduling!